Oh, hi, friend. Oh, hi, my love. I'm just outside. Just you, outside in the beautiful weather. Is it noisy or is it sound okay? No, you sound great. Well, are people coming? Are people coming to, to talk to us? Are, are the people coming to chat? Yeah. Hello, everybody. Did you tell people that we were... Wow, I think I spent... I mean, I... That we were chatting? I... I re Instagrammed your story. So um if if people saw that then they will know um that we were we are live. Chile. Hola Chile. Wow. Um, so I guess we're here because we're on the fifth and final season. We completed shooting before right before Thanksgiving, right Ash? Yeah, right before Thanksgiving and I feel like I feel like we finished around the 15th of November. Yeah, that sounds maybe. Cool. Wait, I don't know. know. I'm throwing a number out there. And then we went off and had our Thanksgiving and it was over. Yeah. And that was it. Oh my goodness. Wait, we have we have questions that have been pulled in from the peoples. Yeah, guys, so they pulled a bunch of questions. We're going to ask each other some questions. But if you guys have some big questions that you want to ask us, hopefully we'll catch it on that quick scroll. So that sounds like that makes sense, no? That sounds like it makes sense to me. Okay. Um, you're going to ask me. I have these written down. Let's see. Um, 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 okay, this is a good one. Okay. So on a scale of 1 to 10... And being good or bad. Okay. One one being not at all. Okay. And ten being very much. Okay. How alike are you to your character? Oh. Um Okay, Ash. I'm curious as to what you think, but I'm gonna say like a four. Better sound. Um Yeah, I'm gonna say four ish. I would say that's accurate for you because I feel like all the cast, you're the least like your character. Yeah, I mean, all the things she's great about that are great about her are the four. Are, is the four is well, what I? Of course, all the good bits. Like, uh, but I definitely channel her when I'm feeling rude. Um, <laughs> you're, you're. I feel like you are so much more um you're less serious than zapata and you're more playful than zapata okay. i'll take that i'll take that i mean there's some things about her that was more right like yeah i mean you're you're just as badass as zapata that's for sure that's all you. you wait so how much do you think you're like patterson I mean, it's weird because I feel like because we played the characters for so long, it's hard not to have bits of ourselves come out. Mm -hmm. But I feel like I don't I, I Patterson is is very type A, very organized. Uh, and I am. I'm not that way. <laughs> I'm very I'm not I'm not very type A or anything like that, but um, it was a very fun character to play, to play somebody who is extremely smart and, um, you know, has her stuff together. And, um, I do think what they did tap into that is truly you is, I think, I think what audiences love about Patterson and what I love about you is that they really let, like, all of your heart and warmth really sparkle through the that that is you well thanks <laughs> um gosh okay what's another question that we have here um let's see okay hardest scene to shoot who's on set just kidding just yeah. kidding <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. I mean, I feel like 
I feel like some of the scenes that we had that were hard to shoot are in this season that are coming up. There are some emotionally hard scenes to shoot, but I think what like a little behind the scenes thing that people who aren't on set don't know is when we're the more people that are on set in general, the longer it takes to shoot. Yes. And also like the more people that are on set, the more the higher it is the likelihood, A number one, that one of us might not know the lines and B number two <laughs> somebody's gonna crack up. Yes, for sure. Right? Definitely. Definitely, definitely. Um, somebody asked on here, I feel like it was, um, were you all besties before the show? And I feel like this is important. We didn't know each other before the show. But I can also tell everybody the moment where we fell in love. Yeah. We fell in love over a cheese plate. Yeah, we did. So, we did. yeah, there was a, 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 a cast dinner, our first cast dinner at some fancy restaurant god knows we where all we met each other for the first time everybody was exactly who they are ash and i were quietly watching everything you and, and i were sitting next to each other you were up there, right? what would you like for dessert they brought us a beautiful little um menu and we both looked at each other and said would you like to share the cheese plate <laughs> <laughs> that was it and that was the rest is history. Yeah, I honestly the the this would have been such a hard experience because I didn't live in New York and because I was commuting back and forth between Los Angeles. I don't know if I I could have uh, survived this sort of journey of working on this show and moving to someplace new like New York without Audrey. It yeah. truly she, just, she showed me New York, we became best friends, and that is my favorite takeaway from Blind Spot. Totally. Audrey as far. Yeah, in general, shooting is so much fun and we're so privileged to do it, but like, I feel that where we were really lucky is we never had an awful day at the same time. So when somebody was down and picked the other person up. Oh, somebody's asking what your name is. Do we, you know. You what? do find you do find out in this season, and I feel like it's it's in an earlier episode in the season. I I'm I'm. It's oh, I just remembered what it was. Yeah. Hmm? So you, I I think you find out fairly early in the season if that episode is where it's where. It's been a while since we've shot this season, so a lot of it I don't remember. Yeah. Um. But so we'll be finding out with the uh, rest of the um the rest of the audience will be like, oh yeah, I forgot about that. So guys, we're answering questions we have, but you all have questions, just ask away and we're happy to ask. We're finally gonna know Patterson's name. This is true. Yes, we will find it out. Um, I'm trying to think of another question that would be fun. I uh, did you take anything from set when we, when we wrapped? Oh, this is like, no, I took something from set when I thought we were maybe going to not come back. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh I remember what this was. Okay. So, but this is also a little bit of a pain in the ass because the butt, sure, because I didn't end up um, using it. So I really loved the rug in Reed's apartment. And I'm not going to say which season this was, but. I thought maybe we might not come back. So I asked for it and they gave it to me and it is too much for my current living room. So see, you're special because I had asked for a painting. I remember I drawing or something in Weller's apartment. They didn't send me that painting. So you got lucky, you got a rug and I didn't get anything. But I, I did swap a little bit because like a year or so later I had some furniture and they took it. So well, there it goes. It all wraps around. I did take a, um, I did take a, a, a Hemingway book, The Sun Also Rises, the old, old copy of it. Um, I didn't tell anybody that I took it. So you now just, people uh, know. <laughs> Say again? Uh, you end up with that mug. There was a, a mug that oh, was. My Critical Role mug, that was mine. 
no, no, That's not that mug. Just the other mug. There was a mug that was maybe um, being passed around. I'm just wondering, did you end up with that mug? I didn't. Well, you might. I might? No, you might not. I might. <laughs> Who has this mug? Oh, that's right. We did pass around a mug. Um, that was just the sort of ongoing joke that we had. We had a mug that we would hide in each other's bags for, you know, everybody in the crew. It was, it was, you'd find it in your backpack or your, like, oh. I wonder who has it. I feel like it's Alexis. It's got, it's got to be Alexis. Okay. Like Wait, what other questions do I have here, Ash? A ver. Okay. A ver, a ver, a ver. They're asking. I don't know how long we're supposed to do this either. I don't either. You guys ask us some questions. Wait, were we supposed to do like 10 minutes? I, I think she said 10 minutes, but up to you guys, you know? A ver. Um... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We just stay on here for like an hour and they're... I know. They're just going to listen to us talk and cook and just be annoying until everybody leaves. <laughs> um, uh, oh. Hi, everybody. Hello, okay. Reese. My goodness. Do Tasha and Reed finally get together? <laughs> How coy. Kind of? <laughs> I guess we'll see. Ki kind of? Ish? Um, ish? Is ish an answer? Yeah, that works. Um, okay. What, without spoiling anything, because as the fans know, not all of us make it through. That's something uh, to, that's something that's highly anticipated. But what would you say is something that, um, blind spot fans can look forward to this next season? Um, I feel like the fact that it is the final season, I think that they can look for a completion of the story. Um, okay. You know, which, which is hard when you watch a show and it might not get picked up or you just don't know what happens or, you know. Um, but we get to finish the story and uh, in natural blind spot fashion, we do it in, in the way that we've been doing all the stories. It's, it's a bit of a wild ride. Um, but yeah, I don't know. What do you think? I think that what people fell in love with, what I would have said I would have fallen in love with as an audience member is the friendships um, and the action sequences. I think that for blind spot fans, there are big, big, high level action sequences that happen in the fifth and final. And um, although the finale was a huge, was full of huge surprises, I do feel like there is a sense of resolution and peace for not all about most of the characters. Yes. I would agree with that. I would agree with that. ¿Quién va a morir? Can't tell you guys. <laughs> Cannot tell you guys. Well, I mean, should we do one more question? Yeah, let's do one more question. In okay. case you guys have some more. Um, um, how... Oh, it's wait. It says, how has the dynamics of our relationship change from beginning to end do you guys mean as characters or as us hmm. well, i mean as us i feel like we've only gotten closer yeah i feel like uh, how i would interpret that question um i feel like somebody said if patterson dies i riot i riot too <laughs> um i feel like our characters probably in the first season or how maybe they had planned for the show may not have been as close had you and I not been real friends. And yeah. Like, I don't know. Yeah. I feel like that, they kind you know, of wrote them like it was slightly adversarial. Like it was kind of like the jocks and the nerds. I wasn't going to say that word. <laughs> it's okay. I wear that title very uh, with, with pride. pride. Yes. Um, yeah, I think, uh, I think it, 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 
our friendship, I feel like, affected how our characters in the show related to each other, which I think is kind of cool. Because um, they knew we loved each other. One okay. of this, this is actually, what's your favorite with each other? I feel like that's a good question to end that's with. That's such a good yeah. question. That's a really that's, hard I question. I know my answer. Wait, do you know it right off the bat? I do. Because it, what the, the scene changed when we started blocking it and rehearsing the scene. And it's the scene where I'm, I'm in the hospital. I don't remember which. <gasps> oh, I like yeah, I, feel like I was hurt a lot in the show, so I can't remember which time it was that it I was, was in the hospital. It Probably. Was, I, in the scene, we talked about having a date. You had a date. And I was telling Reed it was okay to be, um, that I was, I would be his best man at his wedding. That's right. But you were supposed to be sitting in the chair, but you were like, I feel like it would just be this really beautiful scene if we both just kind of like lay in the bed and, and just talk to each other. And would. it just turned out to be such a, it was a small scene, but it was, it felt very impactful and I felt like it really showed our true friendship and um, I loved it. And that was all your idea. You're like, I feel like I want to just like get in there and just make this a really cool, just like interesting and different blocking. And I think it worked. That was so much fun. I'm trying to think of like, I feel like there've been so many moments where things are happening on set and you and I find them the most funny. <laughs> yeah. So I feel like it would, if I were to like pick, it would be really hard to pick one, but it would be a super smash of all the times we cracked each other up on set. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Probably every day because yes. you know, you're, you're, you're going. Because if you're laugh. not crying, you're laughing. Right, Ash? <laughs> yeah. And I'm always laughing because the thing is when you're being so serious all the time, you know, it's so hard. You're, you're, it's so, it's, it's always laughing at the most inopportune times. And you're, you know, especially when you're told like, hey, get it together. You got to stop laughing. So we can change. Like, yes, of course, that makes you want to laugh more. That's right. That's yeah. right. Okay, you guys, do you have any more questions? Hay más preguntas para Ashley Johnson y Audrey Esparza. Que son los actores de Blind Spot and NBC? <laughs> Ah, okay. Talk well, about Zip Patterson. Oh, Zip Patterson. I know. That's, that's, oh. Oh. <gasps> no. I just remembered something that happens in this next season. I remembered something wonderful that happens. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Here's what we can say. Zip Patterson fans will definitely get a something something in yes. the finale. Absolutely. I personally am a fan of patata. I love patata. Patata is because it sounds more like potato. Yeah, that's why I like it. It sounds like a potato. I prefer that. Um, hashtag patata. Potato. Somebody said, okay, Zapata se casa con Reed. Lo que sí les puedo decir es que sí me caso, pero no les puedo decir con quién. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, okay. okay. Are you a hacker in real life? No way. No. Uh, way. But but for all your technological issues, um, um, I would ask Ash. I feel like you know. There's so many people from Brazil. I hear that Blind Spot season four just released in Brazil. Oh, really? Yeah. I know there's a lot of hello Brazil. There's there's a there's a lot out there. That's amazing. I'm so curious as to <laughs> what about the show really impacted Brazil because it feels like it had such a um, such like there's so much love for the show in Brazil and I'm always I'm always so curious as to what it was that caught everybody's attention Patterson can you please hack me yeah I get, it. I get it I don't know how to hack humans yet I'm working on it <laughs> anything else Ash that we missed I don't 
think so. What will you miss most about being on set aside from me? About you, Dave. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, you're you're number one for that. Um, but definitely the crew. Yeah. I feel like I got so close with the crew, and you know, everyone from the camera operators to uh, craft services to all of our amazes that put it crazy hours and don't have a turnaround and would be there before the we were there and after we would leave. Um, I miss that crew, man. New York crew is, is a good crew. I miss them a lot. Right. Okay, Ash, one more question. If you had to play any other blind spot character, who would you play? Ooh. Um... Okay, let's see here. Do you have an answer for that? I mean, my answer used to always be Quayley, who plays Borden. Yeah. Because I just thought it was such a fun character because his turn was so was so quick and sudden and um, unexpected. So I loved that one, and Quayley was so good in it. So I guess I just wanted to play Borden because I wanted to be as good as Quayley. I know I was actually going to say Borden too because I feel like his his storyline is so interesting. Yeah. Uh, Mich Michelle Hurd's character is great. Oh, Shepard is is great. I love Michelle Hurd. And she's so amazing in Picard. If anybody has not watched her in that yet. Um Yeah, I want to say I want to say uh I might say Borden as well. Or um First season, what's his name? Uh, Gaston's character. Oh, oh, yeah. I, that was a fun character to play the to play the bad guy. Tom. Bad guys would be fun. Tom. Tom Riddle. Uh -huh. Do you guys? Do you guys remember what his character's name was? Um. Somebody asked if you could perform with any actor or actress. Who would it be? Like, throw it out there. Ooh, I just had the most random one come to me. And then I lost it. Wait, is it back? Yeah. Nope. Maybe. I, uh, okay, I'm gonna throw one out there just because we've been watching, we just watched Sicario again. And I watched- Benicio? I'm gonna go with Benicio. Benicio del Toro. Uh, similar, if we're just, why don't we just reduce it to Sicario? I would do Emily Blunt, I think is such a beast. Oh. She's so good. So good. She's so good. Yeah. Cuando sacan la quinta temporada? Okay, so the fifth. So you guys, as you guys may have heard, the fifth and final season of Blind Spot airs this Thursday, ten nine Central, on NBC. Um, Tom Carter. Thank you, yeah. Carter. Yes, that'd be fun. It'd be fun to be a bad guy. Yeah. Ash, were there ups and downs on set or just ups? Definitely ups and downs. There's sure. always downs on set because you're the, you're working such weird hours, so you're you're everything becomes magnified, the good and the bad. But um, that's what that's what that's what set life is like. Do you adopt a child with Rich? Every time I think we're gonna hang up, somebody asks a fun <laughs> question. Um. No. No. Okay. <laughs> I had to think about it for a minute. I mean, it's possible that in the future they decide to just like. What if you had a child with me? That'd be dope. I'm into it. We'd be. I feel good like we'd people. raise a good human. I feel like we would. We'd be really good parents together. We'd make a good team. Um. Man, I feel like how important was coffee while filming? Very important. The most important. It's always important in life. Um, well, I feel like we have overstayed our welcome. You guys, thank you <laughs> so much for coming and saying hello. Thank you um, so much. We can't wait for you guys to watch the fifth and final season. We're so excited. We've been sitting on so many secrets. Um, please watch. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us right now and for um, 
going on this five-year journey with us and uh can't wait for you guys to see how it ends yeah okay my love i love you so much i'll call you later all right call you later bye bye everybody bye